This is Audrey, also known as Noble Strength, and welcome to my channel. And today you are tuned in once again for Iconic Style, Fun with Fashion. And today's focus is Michelle Obama. Guys, thank you for the suggestions. Um, I have been leaning towards some other fashionistas that are, you know, iconic in my opinion, but someone suggested Michelle, and I was like, how could I forget Michelle? Yes. Fabulous woman. When I think of Michelle Obama, when it comes to her style, I think classy, bold, elegant. I think uh, confident and what else? Sophisticated. She just embodies, you know, what a woman should be in the sense that she's intelligent. She carries herself well. She's caring and you know, just self-assured and just empathetic and compassionate and all of those wonderful things that she embodies, you know, and we got to see some of that when she was serving as a first lady for our country. So it is with great honor and pleasure that I highlight her today. And who can deny that this woman was stylish. She knew how to dress for her body type. And I think that's really important when it comes to style, knowing how to dress for your body type. Now, Michelle Obama is a pear shape and there are different ways that you can categorize body types. Some people use fruits, some people use shapes, but uh, she's been classified as a pear shape, meaning that her upper body is a little bit smaller than her lower body. She carries more of her weight on her lower body. And not only that, Michelle is an athletic, type of build of a woman, you know, very toned. We all love her shoulders and arms. And because she has an athletic build, she's a pear shape and she's tall, there are certain things that are gonna look better on her. So when it comes to the pear shape, you wanna look for dresses that are A-line, meaning they're kind of fitted at top and then they go outward towards the bottom. They're gonna glide over your hips and draw attention away from your hips. So you wanna wear A-line skirts, you wanna wear dresses that are flowy and long, wrap dresses look good, halter dresses, so anything that shows the shoulders and gives that, you know, more of a broadness up here, especially if you're carrying more of your weight down there. But you just want to go with something that's going to fit your body type. And she's one of those women that knew what worked for her. And that is what she went with. And once you know what works on your body type, most of the time, I would say 99% of the time, you're going to look good. You're going to look pulled together. And that's another thing that I loved about Michelle Obama. Her lines were very clean and everything was just always tailored for her body. It looks so nice. Now, before we head over to the clothing rack, I want to share with you some of my favorite looks that Michelle has worn. Um, so Michelle wore this black fitted dress that had this asymmetrical cut at the collarbone, which was phenomenal. And the shoes kind of played off of that neckline, which I thought was really phenomenal. It just added a sense of edginess, but still classy and elegant in the Michelle Obama way. Another look that I like is when she wore these kind of metallic uh, ombre wash jeans with this peplum top. Phenomenal. She looks so chic and it just had, like I said, that edginess to it. It just brought a sense of style and oomph to her look. It was like she commanded the room, but you know her presence, she just kind of commands the room, not in an intimidating way, you know? And then another look that I liked by Michelle is this black skirt that she wore with this really wide kind of uh, OB style belt. 
just a nice basic boat net black uh, shirt top. Beautiful. Those are some of my favorites that she has worn. So now that I've gushed about the former first lady and her style, let's head over to the clothing rack to see what I pulled from my closet to go along with some of the looks that I found online. And we're going to go with some inspired looks. So if that sounds like fun and something you want to stick around and listen to, Please stay tuned, go get you something to drink, and let's just have a ball playing around. All right, we are over at the clothing rack to see what I have pulled from my closet to go along with some of the images that I drew inspiration from when it comes to Michelle Obama's style. Now, like I said earlier, she has a lot of style and there were so many photos that I could peruse through. It was like I was a kid in a candy store. I had so much fun perusing through all of the photos, but it made it difficult to narrow down and choose. So I ended up going with seven looks that I'm gonna model for you. The first one that I wanna share with you, and I'll model later, but I just wanna kinda of talk about briefly each one before I model them. First outfit that I'm wearing is a red dress by Calvin Klein, which I picked up from Ross. Now this dress fits the check marks for the perfect cut for pear shape. Remember we talked about if you're, wearing, if you're a pear shape, how wearing something that's sleeveless draws your eye upward with this V cut and this collar. It has a wrap dress effect. So a wrap dress is great for pear shape. And then this A-line bottom part of the dress where it goes out away from the body, starting at the waistline. So all of those things are things that really work well for a pear shape, which is what Michelle Obama is and she knew that and she worked with it so you will see a lot of the same i would say silhouettes but with different patterns and prints and colors i got inspiration from michelle obama's beautiful coat and dress ensembles that she would put together so where there was a matching coat and a matching dress so i did not have you know something that i purchased that actually came together as a suit dress so i put something together that i thought would work this is a dress by tahari which is a brand that i guess you would find like at dillard's macy's etc but you have this beautiful embellishment at the top so it draws your eye upward you have this dividing in the waist which draws your attention to the waist and then you have the slimming effect at the bottom. I noticed that most of Michelle Obama's dresses hit her right at the knee, which is very demure and ladylike, but it also draws attention to the calves, which she has very nice legs and calves. She has a short torso, but very, very long legs. And so she just played on all of her assets. And so I think this works with the length of the dress. And then this is the coat that I chose to go with it dress this is a dress by just taylor also a brand that you would find at various department stores this is another perfect example of a nice a-line dress but michelle obama never shied away from bold prints but like i say she always kept with that similar cut and style and this is an example of that you have a bold print but the a-line sleeveless uh dress nice boat neck so it draws attention to the upper body all right for this next dress i was inspired by this look that i'm showing you on the swiss screen where michelle obama was in a dress that was not a line but fitted but it still worked for her so this kind of similar it has this belting here you got the embellishment belting in the middle so it draws your eye to the waist and nice boat neck sleeveless once again drawing your eye upward and this dress is a talbot's dress very classic in design what i love too about michelle obama's style is all of her lines were very clean even though she played around with you know prints and bright colors she still kept her lines very clean which i really like and when it comes to pants she knew what worked for her as well a wide leg pant really looked good on Michelle Obama because it drew attention away from, it just glided over the hips and then kind of like evenly flowed down. It just really looks nice. And she drew, uh, wore a lot of jackets that were a little bit past the waist, kind of crop jackets that drew attention to her smaller body. So in the images that you see, I have pulled some images of her in striped suits which I think she looks phenomenal in. Two were pinstripe, one was a wider stripe, so I went along with that. This is a suit by American Living, and this brand you can find at JCPenney. 
I've had this suit for years. I've had this suit for probably 12 or 13 years, which goes to show you that when something is classic and timeless, you can wear it. It will last you for many, many years. And so this is a wide leg pant, nice little pinstripe suit that you can jazz up with your shoes, your belt, etc. And next one, I drew inspiration from the photo that I'm showing you here where Michelle Obama is wearing a two different color suit where she's one color on top and then another color on the bottom. Once again, a wide leg pant, but a tailored kind of top. So this one I have is by Ann Klein, and this is a black slack with this kind of peplum type jacket that I think would work really well on a pear shape as well. Last look that I drew inspiration from are Michelle Obama's asymmetrical shoulder cut looks. I love an asymmetrical shoulder. I think it looks fabulous and it really looked great on her. So this one is one that I have asymmetrical wide leg pant. And that is it. That's what we're going to be working with today. Stick around for the modeling and be right back. Look number one, I paired this Calvin Klein wrap dress with a pair of Calvin Klein nude pumps to elongate my legs and give the overall look a very polished and slimming effect. And to accessorize, I have a gold citizen's watch and pearl earrings. For look number two, I paired this Tahari black dress with a pair of black Michael Kors Dorsey style pumps. I accessorized with the Gold Citizens watch and a pair of gold hoop earrings. This dress coat is by Calvin Klein and I think it accentuates the dress very well. This bold pink chevron printed just tailored dress is polished off with a pair of nude Calvin Klein pumps, Citizen's gold watch, and a pair of pearl earrings. This red Talbot's dress pairs very well with these black Sam Edelman pumps, a pair of pearl earrings, and the gold citizen's watch. You guys, this segment is called Fun With Fashion, so I had to play around with my Michelle Obama wave. This American Living pinstripe suit pairs well with a cream colored sleeveless top, and I also paired it with some Gianni Bini open toe sandals and the Citizen's Watch and the pearl earrings. This Anne Klein suit has to be one of my favorite suits that I've ever purchased. I purchased it about 12 years ago at Burlington Coat Factory. I love the black rose pin embellishment, the belt, the mandarin collar. I think it pairs well with these black Michael Kors Dorsey pumps. To complete our Michelle Obama inspired looks, I am wearing a Gianni Beanie asymmetrical jumpsuit with a pair of black Gianni Beanie sandals. And there you have it guys, I hope you have fun. Well, it was 
everyone. I hope you enjoyed this segment of my series, Fun with Fashion, Iconic Style, featuring the looks of Michelle Obama. I had so much fun doing this. Thank you so much for the person that suggested this. I can't remember who it was at the moment. But if you have any other suggestions on who else I should feature in this series, let me know in the comments below. I have a few ideas in my head and I will leave a hint at the end of the video of someone that I have in mind. And like I said, share with me your ideas. Let's create some dialogue. Tell me what was your favorite Michelle Obama look. But remember to always be a good steward of all that God has given you because he truly loves us so much. And I will see you next time. Bye. And how can I mention Michelle Obama's style and not mention that infamous White House black market deal that sent many a women scurrying to their computers to order that dress. Michelle Obama appeared on The View in 2008 and they asked her where did she get her dress from that she was wearing and she said White House Black Market and next thing you know that dress was sold out within hours. Amazing. That is why Michelle Obama is a style icon.